All right, guys, we're going to tell a story and lift that mood up. Let's do procrastinator. And it happened. Yeah, I wait till the last minute. Huh. So I had a test, a take home test that I had three days for three days. Are you kidding me? So anyways, so I didn't start it until like maybe Sunday. No, maybe Saturday night. Sunday morning, Sunday night, study with a friend until about 10.30, missed an important call, I'm dumb, anyways, whatever the case, so, then, we decide, okay, we're gonna get up hecka early, so, we're at the school parking lot, the college parking lot, at like, 6 o'clock, no, not even 6 o'clock, sorry, 5.30 in the morning, which is fine, it's happened before, you know, we study, go to take a nap, and that's the end of it, and then start school, whatever. Whatever I decided to eat last night, it didn't go well with me. So, like, I'm in that car, and I gotta use the bathroom. When I tell you I had to go, I had to go. Oh my gosh, it was nobody, nobody was playing. So, I'm in the car, and I'm like, I gotta really use the bathroom. So, I go over to the building where I have my class. It's locked. So... I'm like, okay, I really got to go. So, like, I check all around campus, and it's locked because it's 5.30. So, my dumb self, I get back in the car, great, but I can't sit still because I got to use the bathroom. My friend is like, just go in the woods. I'm like, what? They're like, go in the woods. I'm like, I don't think that's going to happen. They're like, why? I'm like, they're like, oh. I said yes. I had to go to the bathroom. So, I gotta go walk around a little more. I'm like, yo, maybe I can find a cop car. Maybe I can pull one over and be like, hey, yo, let me get a key into the bathroom. So then, I'm going, and I hear a leaf blower. And I'm like, okay, let me go find this guy. Maybe he'll know, tell me where the bathroom is. So, I walk across the bridge, and there's this guy. And so I'm like, hey, question. And keep in mind, it's 530. So this dude doesn't know what I'm doing here. I don't know what I'm doing here. Well, I'm supposed to be studying. But that couldn't happen because I had to use the bathroom. So anyways, talk to this guy. I'm like, okay. So then I'm looking around for a bathroom still because this guy's like, use the central office near the barn. Where the heck is the barn? Anyways, so I'm going around, going around. Wonderful. Great. I don't know where the barn is, so I'm here walking around praying to God that I do not. Exactly. So, I'm walking around. I'm like, <laughs> walking around the entire campus for about an hour. And, you know, it's a little weird seeing a five, five and a half, 17 year old black male in a fluffy black hoodie. Walking around campus at 5 30, 6 o'clock in the morning because nobody's supposed to be here. So I'm walking around and then it hits 6 30. And I already apologized to my friend. I texted him, I was or texted them, I was like, hey yo, I'm sorry, I just I can't sit still because I don't wanna I didn't say that, but I was like, I can't, I don't know what I'm supposed to I don't know. Sorry, fixing something. Anyways, so I'm still walking around, and it's 6.30, and I'm like, okay, I really need to study, but I really need to find this bathroom. So, I'm walking around, and I see a woman. So, I really need this bathroom, and I'm like, okay, let me ask this woman. And so, because I've already tried all these other doors, all these other bathrooms, and it's, I'm like, okay, maybe this will do it. Maybe she'll open the door, maybe because she, maybe she's a teacher. Because I was like, she's parking in this parking lot, she's got to be a teacher. Loves an open door, huh, got him, not for the bathroom. Anyways, so... I go to this woman, keep in mind, it's still shady because it's 6.30 and I'm there in a black hoodie walking around trying to open these doors. You know how creepy that sounds? That is terrifying. I'd be terrified out of my life if I saw me walking around trying to open doors, jingling locks. Are you kidding me? Anyways, whatever the case, well, I'd be scared of me. Okay, anyways, so I'm like, excuse me, ma'am. And I can tell right away she's probably, she's a little concerned because, you know, I'm there. And she's like, yes. And I'm like, do you know? If I can, like, use a bathroom, there's an open bathroom or anything. And she was like, oh. I was like, it's because I'm black. So, it wasn't because I'm black. But, you know, because I'm, uh, you know, I'm looking a little shady because it's 6.30 in the morning. She's like, I actually, I think that all the, everything opens 
um, at like 6.30 that all the uh, everything, you know, all the functions or whatever. But she opens the door and it's like, you can just use the bathroom over there. And actually, I think there's an exit that goes that way. And I was like, okay, thank you so much. I'm sorry to bother you. She was like, and she's like, no problem at all. But then I go use the bathroom. <sighs> Let me tell you that that was one of the most beautiful experiences I've ever had in my life. I felt relieved. My stomach hurt a little, but I went to go study. We didn't get a lot done. We went to sleep. But like, an hour. I walked around for an hour. It was the adventure of Elijah in the black hoodie walking around. I. Moral of the story, use the bathroom before you leave home. And then, study ahead of time. Don't be me. Thank you for listening to this PSA public service announcement.